I am Tom McLaughlin. I am a writer, director, professor here at Chapman Dodge and a rock and roll star. I formed this band originally when I was in the 10th grade back in 1965. It was a great time to be in rock and roll because we were 16, 17 years old and opening for some of the big acts um, that would come to town, the Animals, Pink Floyd, then locally there was Love and The Doors. The whole scene got more and more psychedelic and that was when we started to question, you know, where, it's, where is it all going? Um, so the band broke up. I was a very visual lead singer and many times people said, oh, I bet you studied mime and I didn't even know what the word meant. The French mime Marcel Marceau came to Los Angeles. I went backstage and I kind of showed him how I moved on stage and he says, well, why don't you come to Paris? I'm opening a school. It was life changing. Well, working on Friday the 13th was one of those shows that I didn't really want to do because I love horror movies, but I wanted to make, like I did with my first movie, One Dark Night, kind of a gothic horror movie. And when I asked the producer, can I, you know, he wanted me to write and direct it. I said, when I write it, can I put humor in it? And he says, as long as you don't make fun of Jason. I said, nope, he stays, you know, the unstoppable force. Plus, I'm doing a rewrite of One Dark Night, my first movie, because I felt, you know, after 40 films, I think I can make this better. Roger, Christopher. I guess the thing I love most about teaching is how it fires me up about the very thing I'm talking about. It's that same kind of passion talking about the things that I didn't even know I knew. I'm learning a ton from watching these, you know, these guys. I'm also trying to really get people to understand the craft of filmmaking. Learn all the rules and then you want to break them, break them. Four years ago, I got a phone call from a lawyer. Our first record somehow made it onto this uh, compilation album that came out in the 80s, early 80s, called Back from the Grave. They called it 60s Garage Rock. That song that we recorded, which nobody wanted because the title was Making Love and they wouldn't play that, he said it just sold on eBay for $6,650. And we were like, what? So he had managed by getting a private detective hired to find all of us who were still alive. And then we thought, wouldn't it be fun after 45 years to go in a garage and do this again? So we said, okay, let's start the basics. And we just, every Wednesday we'd get together. And they were, they were terrible, you know? But I saw something in Tom. Little by little, you know, after six, seven, eight months, we started to kind of hone in on certain songs and then we were asked to play a show in San Diego. We're going, I don't, I don't know, I mean, you know, they, they blew us off and then of course I'm the one going, so what, that'll be a great story. You tried to do this, we get in and they threw stuff and, but to our shock, um, they loved it. Suddenly we turned around and we had done like 80 shows. to be like, you know, at one point, Baby Boomer Band, and, you know, we'll play things for everybody going, I remember that song! Yeah. And we avoided that, you know, we kind of went right for, okay, you guys like garage music? You want to see a bunch of guys doing garage music the way we used to do it? And that's kind of made it, you know, fresh and exciting. Passion-wise, I know we're far more excited, you know, getting the chance. It's like having that second opportunity to do something that you never thought you are going to get a chance to do. We had that intro. Things. 
You know, we recorded our first album, and so when I go on stage, my mantra now is, look, no matter what it is that you want to do now, wherever you are in life, don't give up your dream. Because I wanted to do this 50 years ago, and it took me 50 years to actually have an album out. So please, just whatever you're going to do, do it, but don't let that dream go away, because you never know what's going to happen.